Hey guys, uh, I'm just doing a quick video demo of the Donner Emo Amp Controller. Um, I will be doing a, uh, a more in-depth demo and review of it on my YouTube channel, Poor Man Pedals in 2020. Uh, but real quick, it is a passive amp attenuator. Uh, Donner was kind enough to send it out to me. I went ahead, I've got my Parker P38 plugged into my crate uh, 80 watt DS, what it like 80 watt DSP powered thingamajig, the GT80 DSP from crate. Uh, I'm on the rhythm channel. I've got the gain set to about six or seven. I'm on the tube setting. Uh, my level is at about two and a half, um, and. I do not have the pedal in. This pedal goes into the effects loops and is not currently plugged in. It's literally just me going into the amp and the amp has a little bit of reverb set in and it is loud. I don't know how well that's going to show through in the video, but it is mega loud. That was with a single coil and it's very loud right now. Uh, so I'm going to go ahead, plug in to the effects loop. Uh, let's see here. This one goes here. And this one goes here. And you'll notice I do not have any power connected up here. Uh, it can take a 9 volt power supply, and I'll do that in a mi minute. Uh, well, I won't actually do that. Uh, but this is a passive uh, attenuator, which means it doesn't need power to do its job, apparently. So, I'm going to go ahead. I haven't touched any settings on the amp. As you can see, the pedal is set to 9 o'clock. Holy crap, that's a lot quieter. I haven't touched the amp settings at all. Let me go ahead, I'll just turn that up. It's louder. Now, if I were to turn this all the way down, there's no sound coming through the amp at all. I can just talk normal over it, no problem. You, all you hear is the guitar. So there's that. If you have power turned on, what that does is it allows you to activate the foot switch, which has a nice click, and the light would turn on. Maybe it still works. I don't even know. Hey, it still works. All the, the power powers is the light. So there's that. I just discovered that. But if you activate the switch, what that does is it basically acts as a mute button. So yeah, there you go. There is the Donner Emo Amp Controller. Uh, it's very useful uh, if you practice uh, at home a lot and you need something to... You want to keep your amp settings the same as when you play with your band. But uh, you need to that lower volume. This allows you to keep all that headroom in theory, uh, key in theory. Uh, and there you go. So there you go. I hope you enjoyed this. Don't forget, check out Poor Man Pedals in 2020. We have a bunch of new videos coming, uh, including a more in-depth view at this one.